we're back. It's time for game number two. The last we were here, we saw our Detroit Red Wings outmatched in a 3-1 to one loss to the New Jersey Devils. They're heading on home for their season home opener, hosting the Tampa Bay Lightning. If you like these videos, make sure that you hit this one with a like. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. We're going to be going through the entire season. We'll see how the superstar mode of NHL 24 matches up with the performance of the Red Wings during the regular season, as well as the teams throughout the rest of the league. A sold out Little Caesars Arena as every game is sold out from EA Sports NHL 24. We're jumping right in. Huso and Vasilevsky and Net, Point, Kucherov and Hagel starting up front for the Lightning. Larkin between Dabrinkit and David Perron for the Red Wings. Huso makes the save on the first shot of the game by Tampa Bay. Face off to the left of Husso. Point and Larkin. Another win by Tampa. Sergachev in. Back to Kucherov. A nice shot. That's steered aside by Husso. Larkin will pick it up on the far side boards. The Lightning relentless on the forecheck. Hedman steps in. That's kicked aside. The Lightning all over the Red Wings to start the first period this is not the start the red wings wanted to get off to after game one lost to the new jersey devils the lightning have full pressure they win the draw again headman shot off into the corner point now out kucherov a desperation stop by huso he doesn't cover it and kucherov finishes that one off Oh, Detroit behind early, just 4.02 in, point out of the corner. And Huso, I don't know what he was doing there in desperation form, but he just didn't cover it up. He's got to scoop this up here with his stick or put his glove on it. Not much help from the defense as Tampa has been all over Detroit. And another face-off win by point. Hedman throws it around, point out front. Hagel, as they cycle with it at the line, Raymond intercepts, and there goes Robbie Fabry. He's knocked off the puck by Hedman. Kucherov now starts out. He's met by Wallman at center, but he gets the pass up to Stamkos around Petrie. And Huso makes the save. Stamkos with a nice windmill around the veteran defender. Gets the shot off right into the chest of Huso. Tampa has outshot Detroit six to nothing so far in the first. Raymond across to Koffer. He gets the first shot of the game for the Wings. It's a good attempt. But Vasilevsky makes an easy stop. Shiri now tries to get around Petrie who takes the puck. Wings out the change, cop. Brings it over to Rasmussen, gets a nice quick shot away, and Vasilevsky will hang on to it. The Red Wings need to get some second and third chances. It's not typical that you're gonna beat Vasilevsky on the first shot. Vasilevsky's easily handled the first two attempts by the Red Wings. In offensive zone faceoff win, Detroit can't do anything with it. And Cernak now enters the wings line with ease. Janot out front! And he scores again. Tampa with a 2 to nothing lead. Just over halfway through the first period. This is not what the Red Wings had in mind for their home opener, looking for a bounce back after the opening night loss in New Jersey. They're down by two now. 8.33 to play. Cop wins the center ice face off. Cider to Sprung and that one is offside.
Face off just outside the wing zone. Dehan will carry it in for the Lightning across to Genoa. Another shot from the slot. That's where he scored from a, just a minute ago. This time, Huso able to make the save. Detroit is giving up grade A scoring opportunities to the Tampa Bay Lightning. They've already made them pay. Detroit escapes that one. Rasmussen now will get it out and gain the line. Sprung with a quick shot right into the chest of Vasilevsky and who will cover it once again. Good rebound control by Vasilevsky early in this one. Larkin now looking for another offensive zone faceoff win. He gets it. Sider with a quick shot. Vasilevsky will hang on to it once again, not giving Detroit any rebound opportunities. Tampa also doing a good job down low at not letting Detroit get in front. Vasilevsky able to see each of these shots. Tampa out. Janot here on the near side boards. He's bumped off the puck. Gostas Bear with a quick pass to his defense partner, Sider. The wings gain the line. Peron bumped off the puck by Sarnik. Lightning two on two the other way. Janot, he's got one. His shot off his teammate Paul and into the corner. Tampa making a change. Sergachev, Dehan's all alone. Another shot. Oh. Another shot from the slot, a big hit by Sider, and we're gonna have our first scrap of the season. Paul stepping in. He gets a couple rights in on Sider. Sider with a big one, knocks the helmet off. Paul returns the favor. Both men jostling around. Sider with a nice uppercut now. Oh, both land an uppercut. Sider with the reach advantage, but Nick Paul looking strong in this tilt. Back and forth. Fourth they go, and Paul stick it up for his teammate. Takes the big right. It puts him down, and I think Sider is getting an extra two on this one. I don't know if they're calling boarding, charging, but I do believe the ref had his hand up, and the Detroit penalty kill will come out to face this Tampa Bay power play that has not scored yet this season. Ooh, Huso has to cover that up as Mata brought it right in to the crease area. Tampa power play, 2.03 to play in the first. The Lightning lead it two to nothing. Detroit really needs to get out of this one without allowing a power play goal. Comfort out. Oh, Detroit gambling shorthanded and Sorelli the other way. Pass to Shiri. That's blockered aside by Huso. Shiri out now. The Lightning try to set up. Ooh, Wallman might have gotten away with one there as he laid out to block the shot. And Tampa now recovering in their own end. Janot with speed. It's around Hall. A shot. Huso will make the save and he covers it for another face-off. Point and cap to the left of Huso. Point wins it, Stamkos over to Sergachev. Point walking in with a shot glove save by Huso and he will hang on once again. Tampa getting a couple of good looks here on this power play. Still 51 seconds remaining, just over a minute in the period. Cop ties up point and the wing's able to clear. Lightning out again, Kucherov up the left wing side. His shot stopped. And the wings with a chance to clear. Mata almost turned the puck over in front of his net, avoids disaster there. Modern out of Petrie. The wings trying with a man down to get something here and a slash coming on Oli Mata just as time expires. 
on Maury Sider's penalty. Mata with a slash as the wings look to be in another bad spot. Uh, there he goes. He whacked at Kucherov as he was coming up the boards. And probably was going to lead to another breakaway or odd man rush. Takes the call. And Tampa will have a minute 56 to work on fresh ice. And Cider shattered the glass on that hit. I don't think we saw that during the original play. As we look at the stats from the first period, Tampa dominated in time of possession in the attacking zone, 14 to four. They outshot the Red Wings. Their passing was nearly perfect. They also out hit the Red Wings nine to five. They did not score on their first power play but Olimata with a slash, just four seconds left, leaves Tampa a minute 56 to work on the fresh ice. As Cop with a nice move, stepping around the defender, he gets a backhander, and Vasilevsky able to catch that one. Hedman gains the wings line as Tampa will look to set up. Once again on the power play, Stamkos gets in behind the wings defense. He forced a turnover. And able to get a shot in tight on Huso. Wings cop. He's been good on the draws tonight. Wins another one. And the Wings able to clear. Wallman now skating up the left wing side. He dumps it in. Behind Vasilevsky. Tampa out now. Two on one. They have Kucherov takes a shot. That stopped. Good defense by Petrie there as they had a two on one. He took the passing lane away. Kucherov took the shot and Huso able to keep this a two to nothing game. Detroit's been aggressive on their penalty kill trying to create offense. They've been caught a couple times. Stamkos gets a shot, that puck's in the air. Petrie now up to Fisher. The wings get it to center. Hagel the other way, he dumps it in. To the left of Huso, Point takes the puck. Hagel now. He's going to walk right in front. Gets the shot. Oh, another pass out in front. A big save by Huso Kucherov. Tampa is just too much for Detroit. Outmanning them down low. Kucherov with his second of the night. Tampa's first power play goal of the season. Just too many chances. They have Detroit running around down low below the hash marks behind the net. Tampa just dominating the possession. Detroit can't keep up. It was only a matter of time before Tampa made this one a three nothing game. Kucherov from Stankos and Hedman power play goal. Tampa now. In again, out front, Kucherov to Hagel. Detroit able to take it. They need to score soon. Comfer on the far side, his shot, Vasilevsky, as he has done all night. One shot, save and cover the puck. Not giving Detroit any second chances. Relying on his center to win the draw and get the puck out. This time Larkin wins it. Wallman across and Sheary forces at the point, takes it away from Petrie. He'll dump it in and get it. Stamkos out to Sergeyev in all alone. And a save, a sprawling stop by Huso. Detroit making a change as Tampa right back in. Sheary stepping around Hall. Stamkos, he gets a shot. Short side, Huso able to make the save. Detroit's team defense has to be better than this. As Tampa 
continues to mount pressure in the Detroit zone. Gas to spare now. Up to Sider to brink it. We'll start out Perron. He's two, two lightning players. Force the turnover. Now it's Tampa two on two the other way. Sorelli gets a shot kicked away by Huso. Another quality shot from the slot for the Lightning. Larkin out front, the save. Another shot by Larkin. That one's steered aside. So the Detroit finally gets a rebound attempt. Vasilevsky kicks it into the corner. But Tampa now on it, Sergachev. We'll start it up to Paul. Three on two the other way, Janot gets a shot. That's kicked away by Husso. Cernak to Dehan from the slot again. He misses. Cop, here he goes. Does he have the speed out wide? No, he does get a shot. And Tampa is gonna go to the box for a charge. Janot came back and ran through Cop. So Detroit now with an opportunity to stop the bleeding and make this a two goal game. Comfer, Fabry and Sprong, Cop and Sider at the point they lose the draw and it's cleared by the Lightning. Comfer at center, he'll take it in, lose the puck at the Lightning line Bogosian now will dump it in deep. Detroit will have to start over. Cider pressure by Eismont. Comfer able to recover. It's caught now up to Sprong. Back to Fabry with a shot. That stopped. Comfer now. Cop with a shot. That doesn't get through. Detroit another. Fabry blocked again. Comfer now a shot. Another one. Blocked. Does not get through to Vasilevsky. The Lightning get it out to center. Fabry back in. Bogosian. Eismont. Tampa gets it out once again. Glenn Denning through the wings defense. And he gets the shot away. Sider hauled down by his former team. Well, actually, I guess he never was a teammate of Sider's. A former Red Wing Luke Glenn Denning will get a trip. And Detroit now with their best opportunity of the game. They will have a two-man advantage. Their top power play unit is out. 38 seconds to work with a two-man advantage. Nice job tying up, but Detroit still gets it. Raymond clears it into the corner. Larkin outmanned by the Lightning down low and they will clear it to bring it in. Gets it to Raymond, he walks through a shot and a save rebound, Larkin, no! Oh. The, the ref is calling this one off. Raymond gets the shot and I think he bumps Vasilevsky and interferes with him from holding the puck. They're gonna go upstairs, but I think as yeah, you can see Raymond Ran into Vasilevsky, kicking at his stick. Vasilevsky unable to cover that puck, and Larkin puts it in. That will not count. The fans don't like it, but it's a good call by the officials. His interference by Raymond, but they do have another attempt. Raymond to Debrink it. That's stopped. So the Lightning will get a man out of the box. Oh, Paul! Puts the Wings player into the bench. I didn't see who it was. It might have been Fabry. A big hit. Oh, it was Gostaspare. Four of the one, I had the numbers backwards. Paul puts Gostaspare into the Tampa Bay bench and turns it into an opportunity. Detroit. A minute to go on this power play. Gostas Bear, fresh out of the Tampa bench. Larkin to Dabrinkit, back to Larkin, and he scores! Dabrinkit and Larkin. A give and go down low. They're finally able to crack. 
Vasilevsky in the Tampa D. Gastis Bear, Larkin, Dabrinkit. He uses his speed to get behind the Tampa Bay defender right here. Gets it back. He's able to one-time it in to make this a 3-1 hockey game with 3.48 to play in the second period. That's Larkin's first of the season. It's a power play goal from Dabrinkit and Gastisbehere. Point to Hedman. We'll see if Detroit can use that momentum. But right, they, right away they give up a break to Hagel who goes to the backhand. That misses wide. The Wings now will start out. Perron takes a big hit on the far side by Sergachev. Hagel again trying to walk through the Wings D. He stops to Kucherov from the slot. A nice wrister, but Huso able to glove that one down and get the face off. Look at that hit. Perron able to get his head up in time, but he still took a lot of that one from Sergachev right in front of his bench. He hopped off on a change. We'll, we'll watch and see if Perron is any worse for wear after that one. The period comes to a close. Detroit on a goal from Dylan Larkin on the power play, able to get this back to a two goal deficit. Detroit has been outshot by Tampa 27 to 13 in this one. But we'll see, can Detroit get a couple of opportunities? and tie this one up. They lose the opening draw of the period, but they're able to turn it over to the line three on two to bring it to Larkin. He's gonna walk in, his pass goes into the corner. Labrinkit gets a shot as he steals that right at the slot at the hash marks, a prime chance for Dabrinkit. Point behind the net out front, Hagel with an attempt and Husso's able to clear that one away. A penalty coming up in the neutral zone. Dabrinkit was tripped up by Brandon Hagel and Detroit. Fresh off a power play goal by Dylan Larkin will get to try their hand at the power play once again. That's not a penalty that you want to take. A neutral zone trip when you're not outmanned. We'll see what Detroit can do with this one. Fabry taken away by Glendening and cleared. So Detroit now. Their second power play unit is starting this one for them. Fabry gets it in. He's gonna walk in with a shot. Vasilevsky able to kick that to the corner. The Tampa defense let Fabry just walk right in. There's a shot by Fabry on a pass from Sprong. He's going to walk out of the corner. Another behind the back. And it's taken away now by Tampa and cleared. Robbie Fabry, he had a good opening night game in New Jersey against the Devils, scoring the Wings' only goal. A couple good shots tonight. Camper knocked down. And Janot will start back with it. Blocked by Cop and the Red Wings now with 40 seconds on the power play. Comfer out front, Fabry with a blast. And that's gloved down, a big save by Andre Vasilevsky to keep this a three to one hockey game. You see Comfer earlier in the power play on the wrong end of a big hit. Larkin wins it to Perron. He's going to shoot. Oh, he did not get that shot off. Kind of just walked that one right in. Dabrinkit with a big one. Raymond, he's going to go out to Perron. There's a shot. Doesn't get through. The wings still battle, but Tampa will be able to get this one out. Sherry turns it over. Under 10 seconds to go in the man advantage for Detroit. Dabrinkit tries to pass across. That's blocked. By Tampa, the power play is over. 
Hagel tries to center that one, but Huso able to stick it away. 12.30 to play in this hockey game. Detroit still trailing by two. A big blast and the rebound. Raymond will score. Lucas Raymond on the rebound. Gets his first of the season. Larkin made a nice pass to Dabrinkit who fired it. Vasilevsky unable to control the rebound. And Raymond on the backhand uses Vasilevsky's head to put this one in. And just like that, we have a one goal hockey game with just over 11.50 to play. Dabrinkit and Larkin will get the assist on Lucas Raymond's first of the season. And Perron, the wings in again. Unable to get that one through. Sider now forces the turnover in the neutral zone. Larkin with speed. He's going to get a shot. Rebound goes wide. Detroit had an opportunity to tie and just missed. They said it only, they only needed a couple of chances, and it's whether they capitalize or not to make this a tie. Sprung now, three to two, Detroit trailing. Wallman turns it over. Sergachev will start out. Point into the wing zone. There's a shot by Kucherov from the slot, and Huso makes the glove save. You do not want to give up opportunities from the slot to Kucherov and the big shooters from the Tampa Bay Lightning, but Detroit has done it over and over again tonight. It's not going to get them back in the game. Cernak now, his shot steered aside. The Red Wings have played better in this third. Can they score one more? Oh, give it away out in front. Vasilevsky with the stop. Tampa gave it away. And Andre Vasilevsky bails them out. Larkin has a goal and an assist tonight. 4-0-1 to play. Larkin wins it. Perron walks in a nice pass. And Dabrinkit is stopped by Vasilevsky. I think Perron walked that one over a little too much and led Vasilevsky really cutting off the angle for Dabrinkit. There's a shot by Wallman, rebound by Perron. Vasilevsky sprawls and makes the save. So Detroit now getting rebounds, getting those second and third chances that we talked about at the opening of this game that they would need to score on Vasilevsky. He's able to fight that off. Here's Dabrinkit, Larkin, Dabrinkit. Ace, that's not gonna count. Detroit is gonna have this one called back. Dabrinkit with the shot and Larkin. I think he tried to push Vasilevsky into the net. Well, that's an easy no goal call there for the officials. 109 to play. Tampa still leads three to two, but it has been all Detroit. Wallman now. Detroit with the net empty. Fabry to Petrie. Petrie's shot. That's steered aside. Fabry now in the corner, not getting help. Raymond now over. There's a one time shot. And Detroit Comfer going to take an offensive zone trip with 13 seconds to play behind the Tampa net. That if you're JT Comfer, you cannot do that. Not at this stage of the game. That's a bad call, a bad penalty to take at any time during a hockey game. But with 13 seconds to play and all the momentum on your side, the goalie out, that's pretty much going to end the Red Wings' hope of tying this one and forcing overtime. They still have eight seconds left with Hall coming up the boards. Hedman takes it away and the Detroit Red Wings too little too late a Tampa Bay Lightning 
will get their first win of the season. They're able to escape a very good period by the Detroit Red Wings. Detroit now falls to 0-2 on the season. Dylan Larkin with a big night, a goal and an assist to lead his team. But that's all from Little Caesars Arena, the home opener for Detroit. Turned out like the opening night in New Jersey with a loss. They did manage two in this one. Larkin and Raymond, the goal scorers. The final shot totals 31 to 29. We welcome you to come back next time. Hit this video with a like. Make sure you subscribe. I'm Joe, and we'll see you next time from Nationwide Arena.